guys welcome to a new video and i'm starting it from uh highfield road yeah top end of highfield road so uh yeah we're going to go for a little bit of a walk something a little bit more different compared to uh doing town center though so uh yeah we'll see how it goes i hope everyone's keeping well hope everyone's uh having a good Saturday up to now it is of course Saturday the uh, 20th, uh, 22nd of June getting my days mixed up here uh, yeah I hope everyone's doing alright and we'll uh, continue on with this video that I'm doing yeah just top end of high road hope I'm looking at the I was debating whether to wear my hoodie or not, and I've decided, you know what, it's stuff that I'll wear it. Yeah, I mean, look at this weather. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's all happening around here in Blackpool as well. Yeah, we've got sirens going on and everything. Yeah, it looks kind of nice at this one, yeah. I think grass has been cut. I really have it. Walk on this side of the road. So yeah, I'm actually going to take right here and uh, go on to Brinsland Road. Yeah, we're up at the uh, Woodman Howarth Motor Company. And here's Brinsland Road. I'm going to uh, take a walk up here. After I cross over to that side. I'm probably going to regret wearing the hoodie now. Not my luck. I've actually got the uh, sunshine in my face and all. Look at all those things as well across the road. Ooh, they look nice. They're quite new builds. Here's an area that I've uh, not been in. Just some houses around here. Magnolia Way. Yeah, new housing estate. It's nicer. Yeah, we'll tell me I'm not going to Road. I'm pretty sure this is uh, Mitchell Road anyway. Yeah, I was on that side, but pavements are finished, so I'm having to walk this side for a bit now. It's a crossover, to be honest. It looks like it's all greenery over there, that's all. And there's a big ditch. Yeah, I better cross over in a minute again. Cross over, I'm not sure what all that belongs to. Got a greenhouse on there anyway. I've never had to walk down this way ever. It'd be interesting to see what's actually down in. Private road down there. I know, that's nice, all them new houses. Thing is though, these new houses, they're absolutely tiny compared to all the builds. Yeah, just up here then. Uh, got some traffic lights that cuts across. Uh, it's quite a bit late. It cuts onto. It cuts onto the uh, other section of this road, which I know is definitely Midland Road. Not too sure this is actually classed as Midland Road or not. Yeah, we'll find out. Yeah, so we're actually walking along up here up to Wines Gate because uh, I just thought if I go onto Midland Road on School Lane, There'll be no pavement for me to walk on for quite a while, so uh, I'm playing it safe. I'm going the safest way.
Yeah, this is one of the main routes uh, in and out of Blackburn, as well as the Eden Way. So we do come along this way. Well, along that road, you travel that way. That will actually lead you up towards Blackpool Airport and Morrison's and stuff like that. And they'll be able to follow it, follow that round up to uh, Blackpool Plush Beach if you're wanting to go there. I wonder where this side road goes to. <laughs> I think we should take a look and investigate and uh, do a bit of an adventure. <laughs> yeah, see where it goes to. I've got an idea where I think I might be. I don't know for sure. Yeah, it's not exactly the best of roads around here. I was going to continue along that path, but uh, I've never been around this area before. Never have I ever. The site goes on to a windy road. So whether or not I'd actually be able to walk along that road without getting run over is another question. Well they've even got one here for sale as well. Maybe we can take a look. That's oh, probably all the way up there or something. Hey, bear with me a second. I'm going to try and see where I am. Phil lost. There's the look at Google Maps. I think I should actually be alright walking along here. I think being the word. There's a few cuttings over that, so I might use them to my advantage. At least then I suppose I can uh, keep it out of the cars going my way. Yeah, I've never walked along here before. Absolutely gorgeous day. Really is a gorgeous day today. Yeah, I'm trying to find my bearings around here. Oh, that I've never walked along. I realize I never drove along it because I don't need to drive along it. But it'll be interesting to see what's around this area. Now look at the size of this house here. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I won't keep my camera pointing there for too long. Might scare people off a bit. I mean, Jesus Christ, it's a... Uh, it's like in the outskirts of nowhere. 
and the houses are absolutely, well some are absolutely gorgeous and they've got a big plot of land to them, I'll tell you that, they look absolutely massive. So yeah, this is just a little adventure basically. <laughs> Fresh. You see, you can get fresh eggs too for half a dozen. You just drive back down there to get fresh eggs. Nice that they can support your local neighbourhood or local uh, what's what I'm after? Local producer, would it be? I nice think you can help them out. You've got a bubbled uh, up pathway, which is a dead end. How's he been holding up? I think it's just the exterior. At least now I can get onto the pavement anyway. Disagree though. But. It's really kind of a part halfway on the pavement. So you don't have much room to walk past them. But there again, I think I'd rather them be parts on pavement in the middle of the road so you can't get your car past. I'm starting to wish now I just wore a t-shirt. Jesus Christ, it's getting warm. Oh, guard dogs don't want to go there. I'm coming out onto the mainish road here. Who are those two on my way? I think we should uh, try and walk along here, see where we end up. Got some horses there. Ah, oh, look at these. Horses. And trust me to be uh, walking on the road right next to our pavement. Look at that house there. Looks absolutely gorgeous. I wouldn't like to pay mortgage on it yet though. It's absolutely riddled in nettles. I'm going to have to cross over, I think. Otherwise, I'm walking like I'm drunk. Oh, I thought I should be alright for a bit then. I can go over. Oh, I'm on the stony path, but at least I'm on the pavement to a certain degree.
Yeah, I think around this area they don't really intend for people to walk much. I think it's not only this would terrain anyway. Got a house up there, Jesus, I can see them in nowhere. Moss hay, bowling and breathing cows and cattery. I thought it was Kate really. Then it's cattery. So you have cats or dogs and you want a kennel. Even though I'm not biggest of our kennels. Because your dog gets mixed and match with uh, other animals. And you don't know what's going to happen. Nice area down there. Oh wait, it's a caravan camping club down there. Rolls by, well, I'm not sure what that is, to be honest. Belfort, or whatever that may be. Right, yeah, I think I'm going to try and cross over. Get onto the pavement to uh, some degree. You can definitely tell I'm in the middle of nowhere around here. Cars are zooming around the corner. Around here, looks like it's never been cut down. And I'm on a bit of a safe area around here. Definitely tell them that. We don't really want people walking around this area. It's not exactly the best of areas to be walking along. So you're a bit knackered if you can live in one of these houses, which by the way, we've got a lot of land. So if, you want to take, if you've got a dog and you want to take out for a walk, you basically naturally want to you walk out on your own territory. It seems, which seems to me like it's the only way. Yeah, so we can move. I seem to have got myself lost walking about. I'm going to for that, way, so I'm going to continue up here. It's not just feeling like going down there, I know. Crop a road. So I'm going to continue up here. Just hope now there's no car coming for about 10 minutes whilst I'm clearing all this lot. Just me to go for a long adventurous walk somewhere and then end up in the middle of nowhere. Like what the hell is that all about? <laughs> I don't even know where I am. Hey, can meet.
I just came for a long <laughs> random walk thinking, oh yeah. Uh, hopefully I've got somewhere to walk on. I don't want to go near them buggers. Yeah, full of nettles and everything. But you can definitely tell that. <laughs> They don't want people really to be walking along here. Hands less out for cars coming. Yeah, I'm clear for that. That's a nice cottage. Look at the plot of land they've got, Jesus Christ. You know what, I have no idea where we are at this moment in time. Look at that. Yes, I think I do know where I am. I think I do. I think a few more yards and I'll have the uh, VW garage on my right hand side which is lookers I think anyway could be wrong not me I probably am wrong it just looks familiar this road It's too quiet for cars coming the other way. So I think I may be safe. Heat's the empty arm like that and it's not getting used. Actually yeah, I think above me that could be either way. Jesus. Just like this one there. So, I'm trying to find my bearings now. I might be wrong actually, I don't think about, I don't think what because it's up this way. Oh no, it is. It definitely is. So yeah, that's what there's now on the right hand side. Uh, That's a security barrier for something. I think not far. Yeah, look, because it looks fucking there. So that's either one, which carries on along there, pretty much. Yeah, we've got some lovely cars here. I'm not sure about the new golfs. Let me know in the comments down below of what you think to it. But the new golfs look more like human spaceships. Don't get me wrong though, I would love to test drive for all these. Near us, we've got the uh, That black hole rubbish thing there. Yeah, these cars are gorgeous. We haven't got Mercs over there, Mercedes Benz. So I'm going to end that video here. If you liked it, hit like button, hit subscribe. Don't forget to ding on that notification bell for further notifications while I post new videos. I'll catch you all in the next one.